Well, if it is in my fa... Carly, assume you're still publishing that rag of yours. If it bleeds, it leads. And with you out there doing what you're doing, Christ, can't print copies fast enough. You have something for me? Whores. You want high-end whores in the French ward? You go to Handsome Harry Rubber Show, Lou Marcano's hand-picked man. Probably a safe bet that Lou funnels all his VIPs Harry's way. You like to fuck? Harry's the man you want to see. He's got it all covered. Hookers on the corner, porno shoots, and if you got the money, he'll let you live out your sickest fantasies. Usually a good idea to cut off the big money first. Hurt an asshole like Harry right out of the gate. <laughs> I can see the headlines now. New Bordeaux's Blue Bloods cotton sex scandal. Or maybe the city's dark, perverted heart. I'll see what kind of information I can get out of Harry's people about the operation. And the high rollers. Horse for handsome Harry will know what he's up to. Jim? Detective Jim McCormick. All right, Detective. I heard you have a problem with Marcano's drug operation in the French ward. Boy, it's this whole city's problem. His man, Doc Gaston's burrowed down like a fucking cockroach, pumping the whole city full of poison. Where's Doc Gaston operate out of? If I knew that, I'd have him in a cell. Biggest goddamn pusher in the city, and no one knows a fucking thing. The name Sal Marcano tends to do that to people. Fuck Sal Marcano. Best lead I've got is the one of Gaston's suppliers is coming to town. Gonna meet with one of Gaston's people. I can't get any closer, but your friend says you're good at getting information out of people. <laughs> I'll see what I can find out. Be shy about knocking around some of Doc Gaston's boys. Probably the only way to get him to talk. He said he was falling in love with me. You call that a long me! I'm not fucking taking the fall here. That powder was shit. It was shit when I got it and when it got cut. You want to tell Doc Gaston he's running bad product, be my guest. But at the what end of the day, can I that shit you? needs to get sold. Why is he skulking around Don't like get that? a little sick. <laughs> Who they gonna tell? Oh, oh, God. oh, God! Oh, God! Is he creeping up on somebody? How's Doc Gaston running dope through town? The boss's bag men are out collecting. They always take the money back to a stash house somewhere. You work for me now. I'm in the French ward and I can't shake the cops. Gotcha.
go! Got targets on me in the ward. Of course. Be there soon. Yeah, shoot at Chris. Going down. Uh. Jesus. Uh. 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 Can't die like this. Hey, you want a date? Too? Watch it. Make your baby Where's your problem? Good. Takes to get back here. Gonna have to ask piece, you to leave. Yeah? I don't want my brother getting killed by some slanty eyed mud people. Still can't believe it. Goddamn fucking Vietnam. This here is some private shit. Right. Oh, We're going for help! Targets on me in the ward. No, sir. Going our way. What the hell? 
Might have to fold after this one. Sucker! Taking cover! Shit! Fucking stuck! I'm in the French ward. Need to hide some cash. Be there soon. Hearing about a lot of dead dealers, the ones that aren't are finally talking, saying Doc got stones in the system beneath the Big Mouth Jazz Club. You're not gonna try to convince me to let you arrest him, are you? If I wanted to arrest him, I wouldn't have let you be a part of this. Justice might be blind, but it shouldn't be stupid, too. Go do whatever it is you're gonna do. Sure thing, detective. Hey, watch where you're going. Watch where you're going. Coming through. Huh? Hey, watch yourself. Murderer! What the hell? That's my dipshit. I better run, too. I'm not fucking ready, man. Got targets burning down on me in the French ward. No, sir. On our way. No, 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 please. Can't believe you got us in here. Kennedy, baby. This is simply too careful. He's Everybody get! I see him. Run! Run! Look at that crazy. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Getting out of the Oh, shit! No, no, Everybody no. get! No, no, no. Oh, no, no, shit! No, no, please! Run! He killed another one of us! Oh, 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 oh,
a grenade! Don't end you, pal. Dead asshole, 12 o'clock. Get him, oh, much blood. Look at all the blood. It's a goddamn grenade! Son of a bitch, it's going down! Dude. Just get to the phone. That's him. Let's go. Here he is. Get him. Shit, shit. I'm hit. That's right, motherfucker. Get me to a goddamn hospital. <laughs> Fucking freak. Give me some of your men. We're locking down the French war. Yes, of course. But remember me when opportunity knocks again. Get on down, now! Send a new ride to the French war. On it, lad. Just getting her warmed up. That's a big help. He had two problems, just hanging... Sounds, sounds like Handsome Harry's a little agitated. Apparently even his clientele can't get their jollies while being shot at. Is he back at the Pla House? He prefers to call it on Beljardin after the flower shop it's attached to. But yeah, he's there. Probably wishing he had a tit he could cry into. <laughs> you a sick motherfucker, Carly, but thanks for the help. I appreciate you listening as long as you have. I've, uh... Just been a little out of practice. You're not welcome here. Asshole. Who's gonna look at him and think, oh, that's not where I want. Another one. 
Sack of shit down! Trouble. Gotta get behind something. Got targets on me in the ward. You got it. We'll be around shortly. Trouble here. Get your man over to the French ward. I need backup to lock this down. Listen, brother. I expect this district. And I ain't fond of being disappointed. And after Lincoln Clay killed the last, uh, capo, that's when he turned his sights on Sal Marcano. Listen, it's like I said before. It's the same op who ran over in Vietnam. You want to bring down the dipshit in charge? You target their men and infrastructure. Eliminate their ability to fight back. And before they know it, they're standing there all alone, ass hanging out in the wind.
a name for your judge. Cornelius Holden. He just made a call to Luke. First elected him to the Fifth Circuit in 1951. There's something else you should know. Those two men are Lamont Harris and Trey McCall. They were killed by a man named Hollis Dupree. Yeah, I heard he gunned them down when they showed up to his house asking for help. Well, Hollis claims he was in self-defense, said he thought they were there to kill him. Cornelius is the judge that's presiding over the trial. So killing him might kick up a lot of noise. <laughs> Cornelius is an entitled southern asshole. Killing him is gonna do a lot more than kick up some noise. Hopefully, it'll send a message that it's long past the time that those cocksuckers went extinct. That's the car down there that Lou is talking about. That thing armored? I pulled the work order for it. It's a complete custom job. Tough as hell. It'll take a pounding, but it won't be impossible. Cornelius is scheduled to leave any time now, so this is your window. You follow a set route? Not since the trial started, but he still makes a stop or two on the way home. So, you can either hit him then, or go after him when he's driving around. All right. And watch out for the cops. Shoot, what are you waiting for? I don't care. 